So right there in the corner is the hole where we have to insert this pin. And so when you first start, you have to go in like this with the tip and just try and feel where the hole is like this in this position and then push the pin backwards so it is straightened and then you should be able to wiggle it into the hole and uh, up to the flywheel position so so this is how it looks like from this side so this is where the flywheel is and when the pin is far enough it will start engaging with the flywheel and there is a hole on the flywheel where this pin has to go through and once that is done you should have the crankshaft locked sadly i don't have the flywheel for this engine so i can't show you on the engine stand so uh, again this is where the pin has to go and it's quite fiddly first always start with a decent amount of wd-40 or some kind of uh, grease so you clear out the debris and the dirt because as you can imagine this gets uh, full of dirt and then you are not able to insert this locking pin <laughs> 